Hi, my name is Brittany Cruz. I'm here um, as an intern of 2019 at the Inn. Today we got to um, the chance to read John chapter 9 and what we learned in chapter 9 was that Jesus had passed by a man that he saw was blind and the man had no vision um, whatsoever and God gave him the ability to see. He sent him to the pool and just told him to wash his eyes after God had placed um, clay onto his eyes and as soon as he left the pool he had the ability to see the Pharisees were asking him like how did you just get the ability to see and they were really confused to why and they asked his parents they say so is this your son um, was he really blind and they said yes and they asked who healed him they they basically just said you know what you ask him he's old enough to speak for himself so they asked the guy again they said so how did you just get the ability to see like we still don't understand what I got from this passage um, was they were, um, rabbis were asking God why, why was he born blind, like was it because he sinned or was it because his parents sinned, but it wasn't because of um, you sinning, it, it's just the way that God made you and God makes everyone differently, no one's the same, no one has the same fingerprints, like everyone's just born differently, God has a different plan for every single person, so instead of us blaming him for the things that we don't understand and the things that we just can't really get a hold of just thank him for the way that you are thank him that you're not as you're not the same as a person to your left or to your right god has a plan for every single person and it's not the same and you're just gonna have to thank him for the way that you are and thank him for the things that he's already given you so um thank you god for this um devotion that you've given us this morning god I thank you for it, um, just speaking to me in different ways and allowing me to just understand what I read today, God. And I thank you for the way that I am. And I thank you that I don't um, judge myself in any means and that no one um, judges themselves on the way that they look or the way they act because you've made us differently for a reason. So I thank you for that. In Jesus' name I pray, amen.